Make sure you check out AlterRealityGames.com for a great buy list that's constantly updated, great selection of miniature figures, massive single card inventory for numerous TCGs, and also D&D products. Alter Reality Games, play hard or go home. Hello boys and girls, it's tea time. I'm here with Billy Brake. How are you? I'm good. From Texas? Well, I have to get the camera right. Okay. Anyways, uh, how long did your trip take to get up here? Uh, like 16 hours, 17 hours. So it wasn't too bad? It was too bad. It was too bad? Yeah. No, it wasn't that bad. You drove, eh? Yeah, I drove, eh? Okay. That seems, <laughs> that seems very worth it. Yeah, it was fine. His plane tickets were too expensive. All right. Well, what are you playing today? Uh, x Sabers. Okay. Um, Max how do you, my ex. How, wh why are you playing x Sabers and how do you feel they fare in this meta? Um, uh, wait, which question was the first question? <laughs> why did you choose x Sabers and how do you feel that they fare in this meta? Uh, I picked x Sabers because I didn't want to use Gravekeepers and I think those are like really one of your two only options. I, was, I could have picked Dragoonities also, but... Uh, they high on is pretty much the only reason. That card's too good. His uh, warnings at two, and you just seven tools are warning and destroy everything. Triple traps, then I take it. Uh, no, not so much. <laughs> really? You yeah. just you just go balls to the wall and try to hit the yeah, back rows? Yeah, I played at a region last week and I kept drawing dead trap stuns. Like I would high only them and still have a trap stun set. And they never set another back row. Like, it's kind of like a bad philosophy, but it's just it's what's going to work for me, I think. Having book at two, um, do you think that... Having book at two, uh, one, sorry. <laughs> losing two books. And losing two books. Do you feel that's going to be a big hindrance on um, Gravekeepers in general? Or um, do you think this no, will be fine? I, think, uh, I mean, it obviously helps X Savers also because they can't stop me from high end limit. And uh, no, Gravekeepers are fine without two books. I think plants are still live? Yeah, I don't know. I played plants at a local and I got max seed like every turn and I didn't want to play anymore. I was like summon a lone fire and tribute to Dandelion and they max see me and I'd lose. Because they draw like 15 cards? Well, I know they draw two and then I wouldn't do anything else because I didn't want them to draw anymore. Yeah, it's against awful. my nature. Alright. Uh, what else is there to ask you? Um. What decks outside of clearly, uh, you say Gravekeepers, Zunities, and x what do you? What else do you think is, uh, has a good chance of doing well in this tournament? Do you think there might be a rogue uh, deck that climbs? Decks. Oh, six Samurais. Okay. And maybe Nordics. <laughs> Nordics, Nordics. Nordics might be good. I don't know. I've never seen Nordics play, but no, definitely the four best decks I think are six Samurais, Gravekeepers, x Sabers, and uh, Dragoonities. Do you think there's going to be a rogue deck that makes it all the way through? Like, Light Sworn's been doing really well lately Sword. out of randomness. I don't know why. Well, my friend, the one Light Sworn deck that top Dallas is like one of my friends from my local, and it was, yeah, it was pure randomness. But, like, he's not pure randomness, but. Like, yeah. It's not what you said yesterday. But, no, it's just, he's never, I mean, it's just Light Sworn. Light Sworn always has a chance. They mill wolves. Frog Monarchs also have a chance. Okay. Just because they go at once a turn. You know, How do you feel about the Karakari OTK? Um, it's good. Also, Max C's a problem for that deck, but um, like, apparently no Is one Cyber Max Dragon C. a problem yeah, for Cyber that Dragon's deck? Cyber Dragon's a big problem. If you push and can't kill, Cyber Dragon becomes a problem. Okay. One of the reasons I didn't use the deck. What thing, well, what about Gladiator Beast? It's the beginning of the format. Why does it I, mean, they, I don't like them, but they always have a shot. But okay. I don't think they're going to I definitely don't think they're going to win. But you think they're going to top? Maybe one or two. What's the meta like in Texas right now? Um, whatever we're playing. Um, like... Uh, X Sabers and Dragoonities, pretty much. Grave Keepers, those three decks. Okay. And Six Samurais, those four. That's pretty much it. Well, what's the best way for dealing with Dragoonities, would you say? Typhoon. Typhoon. Mystical Space Typhoon. I, I mean, outside of Mystical Space Typhoon. <laughs> um, uh, outside, first, outside of Solemn Judgment. What is, what is the best way of dealing with them? Going first. Um, That's a boost, yeah. yeah. Getting rid of their ravines. Not letting them draw a ravine. Chain Disappearance is a side deck way to go about it. Just remove their flanks, and all they can do is legionnaire you. Okay. The starters can't stop Chain Disappearance. That's true. Um, I think that's all I got for you. All right, thanks, Bill. Havoc 41. Woo!